Today, we have some important news for Samsung Galaxy users. As we all know, Samsung provides major Android OS updates for a certain period, and this year, 2024, marks a significant milestone for several Galaxy devices. In this video, we'll discuss which Samsung Galaxy devices are receiving their final major update with Android 15 through 1 UI 7, and what this means for you as a user. So let's dive right in. Every year, certain Samsung Galaxy devices reach the end of their update cycle. This means they will no longer receive major Android OS updates after their last scheduled update. In 2024, a number of popular Galaxy smartphones are slated to receive their final major update with Android 15, delivered through One UI 7. This is an important moment as it marks the last time these devices will receive new features and improvements directly from Samsung. Staying informed about the update schedule is crucial for several reasons. First, it helps you keep track of the latest features and improvements your device can receive. Second, it allows you to plan for future changes such as upgrading your device. Knowing when your device will stop receiving updates ensures that you can make informed decisions to stay up to date with the latest technology, enhancing your overall user experience and security. Samsung has officially announced that 12 of its Galaxy smartphones will receive the One UI 7 update based on Android 15, marking the end of major updates for these devices. Here's the list of devices that will receive their final update. Galaxy S21, Galaxy S21 Plus, Galaxy S21 Ultra, Galaxy Note 20, Galaxy Note 20 Ultra, Galaxy S20, Galaxy S20 Plus, Galaxy S20 Ultra, Galaxy S20 Fan Edition, Galaxy Z Fold 2, Galaxy Z Flip 5G, Galaxy S72. These devices will benefit from the new features and improvements that One UI 7 and Android 15 bring. However, after this update, they will not receive any more major OS upgrades from Samsung. Now let's talk about the devices that are likely to be supported for Android 15 and One UI 7. While the official list of supported devices is typically released after the first Galaxy smartphone gets the update, we can make an educated guess based on Samsung's update history. Here's an unofficial list of Samsung Galaxy devices expected to receive Android 15. Galaxy S series, including the latest Galaxy S24 series, Galaxy S23 series, Galaxy S23 Fan Edition, and Galaxy S22 series. Galaxy S21 Fan Edition and Galaxy S21 series. Although the S21 series will receive its last improved performance. Are you excited about the upcoming One UI 7.0 update? It's always thrilling to see what new features and improvements come with each update. Remember, staying updated helps you get the most out of your device, both in terms of functionality and security. That's it for today. What are your thoughts on this update? Are you using one of the devices getting its last major update, or are you looking forward to the new features on a newer device? Let me know in the comments section below. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to stay updated with all the latest tech news and reviews. As always, see you in the next video. Today, we've got some exciting news about Samsung's upcoming foldable smartphones. If you're a tech enthusiast, you're definitely going to want to stick around for this one. We're talking about the highly anticipated Galaxy Z Fold 6 series, and more specifically, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, which is rumored to be coming to China and Korea. Let's dive right in. Among the many Galaxy Z Fold 6 models that are currently in development in Samsung's labs, the one that has everyone buzzing is the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Now, if you're familiar with Samsung's ultra-branded smartphones, you know they are designed to be the best of the best, offering high-end features and cutting-edge technology. While the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 is expected to bring some minor incremental upgrades, all eyes are undoubtedly on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. However, here's the catch. The Ultra isn't expected to get a global release. But don't worry, it seems this powerhouse of a device won't be restricted to just Samsung's home country, South Korea. According to the folks over at Android Headlines, Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra could also be launching in China. This is particularly interesting because it seems the rumored Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim, which we've been hearing about with its slimmer body, bigger displays, and larger battery, might actually be the Chinese variant of the Fold 6 Ultra. If this is true, it would clear up some of the confusion we've seen in recent weeks about how many models Samsung is actually working on. It might just be two. The Galaxy Z Fold 6 and the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, the Ultra, limited to Korea and China for now, would allow Samsung to gauge interest levels before potentially bringing it to a wider audience. In China, the Z Fold 6 Ultra may be sold as the Samsung Go U25, complete with unique visual touches like decorative engravings on the hinge, similar to previous Samsung Gilead smartphones. And here's another interesting tidbit. China might also get the Galaxy Z Flip 6 as the W25 Flip. 
This is speculative at this point, but it aligns with rumors that Samsung is also working on a Galaxy Z Flip 6 Slim. Now, unfortunately, there isn't a lot of detailed information about what exactly the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra will offer compared to the Z Fold 6. This is probably because the Ultra model isn't launching alongside the standard model, but we can expect more details to emerge once the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 goes official at Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked event next month. Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked events are always full of surprises and we can't wait to see what they have in store for us this time. Will the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra live up to the hype? Will it bring groundbreaking features that set apart from the standard model? Only time will tell. To be an upgrade. While rumors suggest a larger display and a slimmer design, the lack of S Pen support might be a deal breaker for some users. Ross Yanon also mentioned that production for the Z Fold 6 Ultra's display panels might begin later this year, with a launch expected in January alongside the Galaxy S25. This staggered release makes sense. It avoids competing with the July launch of the regular Fold 6 and keeps the Ultra exclusive to South Korea for now, which might frustrate international buyers. Speaking of launches, rumors suggest the next Galaxy Unpacked event might be happening on July 10th in Paris, France. However, Tipster E-Leak's list of expected reveals didn't include the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Does this mean no Fold 6 Ultra this year? Probably not. E-Leak's list might only include devices long leaked photo a few days ago, looks a bit cheap and out of place on a flagship smartphone expected to cost over $1,500. The device in the picture also appears to be wider than the current Galaxy Z Fold models, suggesting that Samsung is increasing the display size. However, the screens won't be significantly bigger. Samsung is reportedly saving the major display size upgrade for the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra and Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim models, which are rumored to launch alongside the standard Z Fold 6 this year. Now, let's move to the front. The first hands-on image of the Galaxy Z Fold 6 has leaked and reveals that Samsung has finally listened to Galaxy Z Fold users. The new foldable phone will feature a wider cover screen compared to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. Reliable tipster Ice Universe shared this full image showing the front of the device and comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. As you can see, the upcoming foldable phone will have a wider cover screen that matches the width of the Galaxy Z Fold 5's cover screen plus one of its bezels. This wider cover screen should improve the typing experience on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and resolve aspect ratio issues in some apps and games. The new foldable also appears to have much sharper corners for both the body and the cover screen. A tipster shared a photo that seems to show a new camera module for the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. Although the leak only indicates that the camera module will feature a new design, it's doubtful Samsung would implement a design change without also upgrading the camera hardware. Here we have the first look at the new Galaxy Z Fold 6 outer display. A Twitter user named Ali recently shared a render comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. According to Ali, the new outer display features a boxier design and a slimmer hinge, significantly enhancing a Fold 6's overall appearance. The most noticeable difference between the Fold 5 and Fold 6 is the wider cover display. The render clearly shows what do you think about these changes? Are you excited about the wider cover screen and new design? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with all the latest tech news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.